Hey, YouTubers, how's it going? This is Let's Play Rainbow Six Vegas 2. Um, I'm on the fourth mission now. I'm gonna switch back to my other sniper rifle. Um, yeah. Ooh, let's go with the PHG. It's a new one. M40 is nice, but I want my the silent one. SV98. Mm, okay. Now let's get started. I'm on the uh, fourth mission, and the bomb just went off. And now we're trying to track down uh, a van that's on the run. Let's try this PhD out. And let's see if we can catch him. And I'm still doing my um, pistols and sniper only. And my team still gets in my way and still has my kills. Ow. Dude, what are you sh- I don't know. But... Yep. Alright, this is how you shoot a guy. Oh, I can't shoot it. It's concrete move, that's why. Oh, I was thinking about I may do one level with nothing but assault uh, with assault rifles or how how we normally play. Oh crap! Oh, I died. Uh, like with assault rifles, it's to show you how the assault rifles fire and all that stuff. Uh, if I do that, it'll probably be the next level or the next um, level after that. So look forward to it. Damn. This is funny. I actually, guys, get out of my way. Yeah. When I when I see people are, uh, playing Rainbow Six with the sniper rifle, I always find it at least terrifying. With the sniper rifle, I always kind of laugh at them because you're not going to last long with the sniper rifle. But I guess if you're good enough, then you can do it. Bam! Headshot. I'm just going to work on the settings. Uh, options, video, quality, no, high. What's the sound? Not under controller. Drill? Shit, why is it at one? Three. I'm going to see how that sounds because for some reason in my past videos. You can't hear anything. And I said, I'm sorry about that. Okay, now. Quick scope. Somewhat. Yeah, in Call of Duty series, I'm not really the big, big fan of quick scoping. To me, it's really unrealistic and. It kind of pisses me off when you know you're unloading on a guy and he just quick scopes you. Because one shot with the sniper rifle, you're dead, and at least takes about six to ten bullets to kill somebody. So even though you get the jump on him, he just quick scopes you and you're dead. It kind of screws you over. Um, but there's a lot of problems I have with the, I have with the Call of Duty series. But there's a lot of things I like about it as well, which I like the matchmaking, the ranking up system, the prestige. I hate how they promote noobs. I, sh I guess you can say it like giving them noob tubes, shields, and uh, danger close and all the crap. But it's still a good game. I mean, bam, headshot. Bam, headshot. A little long one to take, but yeah. Oh, if you noticed, I customized my dude. Look at that. Urban camo. I've only really unlocked a few camo sets, so you can't see like what I really want him to do. 
and I don't have the armor I normally choose yet, so just wait and see, and you'll see some more of my um, more sexier guy. Um, but he is pretty damn sexy, kind of like me. Well, I'm almost out of bullets. Shit. See, he turns to be very stupid like that sometimes. And let's reload. And sometimes you can be right in front of a freaking terrorist and they would like not shoot you. And sometimes they'll do a 360 spin and shoot you in the head. So, uh, damn, let's shoot him through the wood. Let's take a look at my Asus after I kill this guy. Wait, never mind. Asus. Marksman, level 14, CQB, level 11, and Assault, level 6. Assault is the hardest one to level up because you only get kills with explosives or carry guy in a turret or kill a shielded opponent, but you never come across a guy with a turret or a shield. So basically, you just kill through with the cover, you just, uh, blow them up, and that's about it. Okay. I'll go through the other ones too. Okay, uh, marksman is kill opponent at long range. Kill opponent that's using a rope, which happens quite often if you play the right levels. Uh, headshot happens all the time. Kill a sprinter happens all the time when you're playing online. Kill while using a rope. If you get on a rope, you get a kill, you get that. CQB. Kill a enemy using blind fire, pretty easy. Uh, kill a visually impaired opponent, just use a flash bang. Uh, kill the opponent from behind, just shoot him from behind in short range. And we shall do the assault. Okay, back to the game. I suppose there's a gap right here. No, don't pick that up. The other problem with this game, if you just wanna switch weapon, like go down to switch grenades or something. Oh no, what's my other fucking gun? Alright, good, got my sniper rifle back. Damn. Alright, I guess he's not there. I don't need to worry about him. And look, there's that same bullet hole pattern. Deja vu. Okay. Actually, one really cool thing about this game, which I probably can't do on this level, but if you want to bring out like some terrorist, make that noise and terrorist will come and check out, see what it is. But that's more of a terrorist hunt thing than a single player thing. It would just come off stupid if you do it in a multiplayer. Hey look, there's that same bullet hole pattern again. Get me one. Actually, I'm gonna take me a different type of sniping scope. Twelve times, and yeah, never mind. Maybe like an ACOG or an iron scope on the sniper, that'll make it so cool. But then it won't be considered a sniper, would it? Actually, what have you guys entered through? There. 
and go silent. Weapons free. Open sesame. Alright. I'm gonna try to take as many people as I can before I send my team in. Which let's hope I can find some people. Oh, this is not my silent gun, is it? You know, if you have a silent weapon, you can go down and start taking out people like crazy. And they won't even know. They'll just keep on walking around. But if they see a body, then you're kind of screwed. Bam! Headshot. Crap, they get off the door. This control is broken as hell. Alright. I can still get him in the room if I need to. Alright, let's see if they... Bam! Headshot. Start sending them in there. Because I don't have all day to get them. I'm killing plenty of enemies. See if I can get him from behind. Mm. 